So let's go ahead and copy this. Let's come over to PowerShell. I'm gonna paste this in. All right, and then this last command is a Windows native PowerShell so that we can see that we can in fact parse out the comments, okay? Also coming back into the properties hunt, remember on index 24 from before, it is empty, okay? However, if we run it again, we see that on index 24, the malicious payload has been placed inside. So let's take a look at our cat picture. And you notice everything's the same. He's still adorable. He wouldn't hurt anybody. So again, opening up this image is not enough for the attacker. In order for that to happen, the attacker would need to find some zero day exploit on the photo viewer, right? They would basically be like escaping intended execution and somehow invoking it through the photo viewer. So in this example, the attacker is going to use a Microsoft Word macro to extract that comment. 